Hi, I'm Candy Shaw. I hope you enjoy some of these tips and tricks to help you strengthen your craft and excite your guest. After applying a base color in the flats and underneath the occipital bone of the hair, I take the balayage lightener and I begin by creating peaks and valleys of light throughout the hair. I'm going to go back and paint and melt in the chocolate brown color throughout as well. So I'm just pivoting around the hair and now melting in the color. Here I don't need a paddle, I can just freehand the darker color. This is the crown, the piece is going to pop. So here I'm going to create a big V pattern, making sure that I paint the money piece. Following the shape of the haircut in a V. Around the face, I tilt the head back, making sure that I can get close to the scalp when I'm painting my balayage, and adding a lot of pressure to the ends. Now I'm just painting the tips of the hair, just to create an ombre effect in the short haircut. Here, again, a big V right on the hairline. This will ensure that I have a lot of strength in the bang. I hold the two pieces together in a crochet method and paint heavily to the ends, making sure that I have even saturation. Then I drop the hair back. Now I'm teasing the hair up. This is just the center part of the haircut. So I tease the hair really strongly at the regrowth and let the ends come free. By taking my darker color, I apply the darker color throughout the base of that hair and then take my lightener and just paint the tips. This is called minking. Keep applying, making sure that you've got even saturation. I hope I left you wanting more. Check us out on jamesonshaw.com for more information on how to get my DVDs.